All right, so we got Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3 and Warzone Season 4 at launch trailers. Go to video. Bro, listen, these Call of Duty seasons be flying by, bro. That's Season 4. Oh. Uh-oh, that was a dog. I just saw, I just seen a dog. So we got Tokyo. Wait, is that resist? Paris? This is like resistance. Wait, is that? Whoa! Wait. Clock's ticking. Wait, is, uh, I thought that was something else. Stop the contamination. Okay, I'm gonna be on. Hey, you know what? Can I be honest with y'all real quick? So this right. Oh, I'm, oh, my bad. Hold on. Let me. I, you, you guys already know tradition. Give me one second. PlayStation. Now listen, real quick. I'm gonna be honest with you. Um, this this Paris map looks very much like Resistance. Now, if you guys don't know res, uh, what Resistance is, if you guys don't go back to like the Call of Duty Modern Warfare. Uh, in 2011, there used to be a map called Resistance. Oh my God, bro! I used to watch Allie go for like wave 30 in survival mode on like the map Resistance. Like it was absolutely crazy. Um, but here's what I'll say, bro. Like I know a lot of people make fun of Call of Duty, saying, "Oh, well, you know, they don't really have that, you know, that much content or whatever. Like the game is dry." Da 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 da. And I'm gonna be honest with you. Like sometimes the game can get dry, just like you know any other game, you know. So I don't really uh, go too hard on Call of Duty for that because. I mean, you know, that's hard to do. That's hard to, you know, you know, make new content and make new updates like every single week. Like, I mean, Fortnite can do it. You know, it's because Fortnite is Fortnite. You know, Fortnite is more like a, I don't know. Fortnite is is Fortnite is a game to where, you know, at the end of the day, you know, it's not Fortnite's fault that they can that they can only do that. But at the end of the day, Fortnite is a game to where they can literally put anything in the game. And it can just like they, no, they can legit put anything again. Like I don't think people know that Fortnite can legit put anything in the game, bro, bro. They can have like an update for this game every single week. I'm gonna be, I'm, I mean, they do, but like I'm talking about, they can have like a major update for the game every single week. I'm talking about, bro, every single Tuesday. So at the end of the day, yes, that is very hard to do, and so this is why I don't go crazy on Call of Duty saying, oh well, you guys are out of content, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera, you know, I don't really hop on a train. Um, but here's what I'll say. Uh, season four with the new map of Paris, with new map of Tokyo. Now I'm gonna be honest, Tokyo looks crazy. Tokyo looks absolutely crazy. And one thing that I actually wanted to say, uh, that that I actually wanted to mention in the last Call of Duty video, uh, in a video where like you know where uh where a guy or a girl they literally listed all the Call of Duties from like the first one to the last one. Um, I just noticed something that, and it actually well the game's been out, but I just noticed that in Call of Duty Modern Warfare Three, in in the, in the most recent one. I didn't really see any dogs. Now, if you guys don't know, Modern Warfare 3 and like Modern Warfare 3 2011 version, um, like the dogs were like a big thing. You know, bro, those attack dogs. Oh my god, bro, I used to be so scared of those attack dogs in like um and like in like the survival mode. Oh man. But um I'm actually glad to see a dog in the game. Uh I think this is in my personal opinion, this is my first time ever seeing like a dog in like a cutscene for Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3 for like their most recent one. So that's actually pretty new uh, as well to me. I mean, if you guys have seen them, then, you know, this, this obviously this is my first time. So this is why I'm saying that. But Tokyo looks pretty nice. Paris looks very, you know, familiar to uh, to the map Resistance. So um, that that's definitely um, uh, nostalgic, if you'll say. But, like, look at this. Wait, wait, wait. If you guys remember the map. Listen, I'm sorry I got to go on a rant for this. But, like, if you guys couldn't tell, like, look at the buildings, like. This doesn't remind you like the old map, like Resistance, like or am I wrong? Tell me if I'm wrong or not in the comment section down below. Um, but yeah, Resi uh, Paris looks nice, Tokyo looks nice, and then this thing with the um, and then this thing with the with the contamination type of thing. I'm guessing you have to like stop the gas or something like that. Um, it's kind of like it, it kind of goes along with like the story mode to where you have to like stop like the nuke or whatever, like the nuke from that gas or whatever. Uh, whenever Makarov launched the missile and like it hit the uh, like the army base and everybody was dying You had to like I think you were last low and you had to jump to the to the helicopter That was actually a pretty good mission uh, To where like, you know, you probably had to like stop the gas or whatever um, But other than that, I'm gonna be honest with you like this mask right here. Give me one second This mask right here. I'm gonna be honest with you like out of all the skins that I've seen Here's the thing, right? 
I don't mind them putting like Kevin Durant and like Devin Booker and Messi. I don't mind them putting like these athletes and stuff like that in the game. I don't have a problem with that. But like if if they can just like I feel like Call of Duty succeeds when they're when they're more simple, you know, um, like when they are. And I'm not saying that you can't try different things. I'm not saying that at all. I'm just saying when Call of Duty is just simple, like this right here is simple. Like you just take a random like you know operator. You put the mask on. You have like the gas foaming through the mask. You have like them with the green eyes. Like that's hard. Like I'm gonna be honest with you. Like like that's tight. Like that that's really cool. So in, in my personal opinion, and that's something really simple compared to like, um, like a like a Godzilla skin. Even though like th that's not bad or anything. I'm I'm just comparing it to like a skin that required like it, it requires way more like animation stuff like that. But like this right here is very simple. Green eyes with the gas foaming out the. Well, uh, gas foaming out the mask. That's just very simple. I like that a lot. And uh, I just wish Call of Duty would just like do more of like more simple stuff. You know, um, I, I just feel like sometimes um, Call of Duty they can get too. They can they can they try to jump ahead too much, and 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 they mess up. And then once they notice that they mess up, they try to jump back and they end up jumping um, for, like further back before they jumped. If that makes sense. I don't know if you guys know what I mean by that, but try to think about what I said. Uh, because I I have trouble like trying to like <laughs> I have trouble like trying to put analogies together. So if I like if I if my uh, like analogies seem like a little off or, like different whatever, try your best to try to understand what I'm saying. If you don't get it, it's fine. I, sometimes I don't understand me either. Other than comment down below, what do you guys think about season four of Call of Duty Modern Warfare uh, and Warzone? Do you guys have anything to say? And